So somebody has brought me this uh, Acer laptop and a uh, rather a strange story associated with it. Uh, apparently some time ago it decided to upgrade itself to Windows 10 and then after a while the, uh, the person decided that they didn't really like Windows 10. I mean, what's not to like about Windows 10? No, don't start me. So, uh, decided to revert to the factory installed operating system, which was Windows 7, using the uh, utilities in, built in. But somehow, during the process, uh, it's managed to lock both the BIOS and the hard disk. And the guy has absolutely no idea of what the password is. He says he never said a password. So, uh, it's been brought to me. So here we can see uh, that uh, obviously it's asking for uh, the security code. So we put it in, we have no idea what it is. We can put random stuff in. You can try all the usual things, but password check failed. And once again, we can try password check failed. Password check failed. And then we get unlock password. Now, what's interesting about this, um, doing some research online, is that um, if you can see at the end here, it says enter unlock password key and then uh, some, some numbers. So what's all that about? Well, I do remember seeing on the uh, on the internet that um, somebody has written a, an application to try and determine from this key what the password is. So um, let's check that out. Okay, so here's the the website. I'll put a link in the description: biospassword.org, and enter your code. So the code from the system. Is as follows get password now, interestingly um, the first hit is for this BIOS which is Acer and it's an Acer machine so this apparently should be the the code that we need to enter to uh, unlock at least the, the hard drive let's see so let's try the, the code and see what happens Well, as we can see now, the uh, the hard drive is unlocked and it's trying to, to load Windows. So that's so far so good. Um, the only other issue is that um, we still have the, the BIOS locked, which um, we need to sort that out as well. So having managed to unlock the, the hard drive, the issue we have now is to try and unlock the, the BIOS itself. Now, the machine will automatically try and boot from the hard drive and there's no F12 option to select any alternative drive. Now we need to boot from an external USB drive so that we can run a utility to clear this this password. So I guess the only option is to uh, remove the hard drive uh, which on this particular model means dismantling the entire thing. Thank you, Asa. So having removed uh, some screws from below and uh, a few zillion from the top and the keyboard, uh, we can now remove the hard drive and then see if we can get to boot from the USB stick. So now I'm just going to power it on and uh, see if we can get it booted. Uh, that's interesting. It has Actually, if you noticed, it had the F12 menu there, and it now has uh, has booted from the from the pen drive, which is excellent. So we can go to the next step. Um, so we've got to the 
the C prompt and as I will explain um, we needed to download this clean password utility which is from Acer so let's just run that and we have the options here one or two to clear the user password or the supervisor password and it's already cleaned the user password so we've cleaned the supervisor password so now if we remove the uh, pen drive and reboot Hurrah! So we've cleared the CMOS password and obviously we're going to the security we can see that before we used that other program to clear the the hard drive password as well so that is excellent we can now move on to the next stage which is uh, reinstalling windows happy days so having gone through all the fun of uh, reinstalling windows let's see finally if the thing is going to boot up So, looks like a, another successful repair. Please like, subscribe and uh, share.